Hello, I'm Anu from Just Tutors and today's video we are going to learn about number work. So let's move forward and see the subtopics that we are going to learn in this. Well, we are going to learn about introducing hundreds, then introducing three digit numbers and then reading and writing three digit numbers. Now let's move forward and try some warm up questions. These are the warm up questions. For trying them, you can pause this video and once you are done, you can resume and check your answers. Well, these are the answers you can compare. Thumbs up for trying them and congratulations if you are correct. Now let's get started. So we are going to learn about introducing 100. Well, if you have heard about and if, if you like about, about cricket, then you must be knowing about Dhoni. And you also have heard about century, that Dhoni has scored a century. Well, a century means 100 units. So if he has scored a century, that means he has scored 10 runs. Sorry, 100 runs. Well, a 100 consists of 10 tens. So if you have 10 rupee note, and if you have 10 10 rupee note, then you would have 100 in total. Similarly, if you have 100 1 rupee coin, then it is equal to 100 as 100 units is also 100. Now let's move forward and learn about 3 digit number. Well 3 digit number has hundreds, tens and ones. So there's this example. Let's see how we can read and understand about it. So this has 5 ones four tens and one hundreds. That means we can say it has one hundred, forty and five and all together we will say one hundred and forty five. Now let's work out on similar examples. There's this number. It has two hundreds, eight tens and zero ones. Therefore this number is two hundred and eighty. Similarly, this number is 110, this number is 654, 987. Now let's move forward and learn about writing hundreds. Here we have to count up in tens and complete the table below. That means we will have to add 10 in each step. So 100 at 10 makes 110. Then 110 add a 10 makes 120, then 130, then the next number should be 140, then 150, then 160, 170, 180, then 190, 200, 210, 220, 230, and then 240. Congratulations, we have completed this table. Now it's time to practice some questions. These are three questions that you may practice. For them, you can pause this video and work it out. And once you are done, you can compare with the answers. Well, these are the answers. Thumbs up for trying them. And congratulations if you are correct. Well, this is all for this video. For more, you uh, can visit justtutors.com.